food. Wait a second. Are you sure this isn't cat food? Vegan tuna. <laughs> Well, since you guys all know how much I like eating shitty vegan food, I thought I would give myself another excuse <laughs> by making another vegan taste test video. And here with me we have my only other <laughs> friend who's like as big of a foodie as me. <laughs> We can so, chow down. This is my friend David, and you don't know his face. Um, yeah, we we both get real into the vegan junk. A lot of it. Yeah. <laughs> and I just want to say before we get started, because some people were really confused in the last video, this is not the kind of food that I eat. Like, this is not like my standard diet. A lot of people <laughs> are like, oh, are you... I thought vegans were supposed to be healthy. Like you, this is like this is awful. What is this? I'm like, it's junk food. Once in a great while, just, it's junk food. Yeah, just, exactly. Just like meat eaters eat like fucking pizza rolls and hot pockets. It's like this is the equivalent. Exactly. Moderately, or sometimes you have the days where it's all you eat. But that, <laughs> is that just me? <laughs> no, <we're> girl. <laughs> Lots of stuff here, and for the most part, I kind of tend to get the things that seem gross <laughs> or like that just will be interesting for you guys to watch me try like I'm not gonna get like obviously like fruit granola bars to try on a taste test because that's not entertaining no. so we got some weird shit <laughs> a lot of weird a lot all right here we go we got vegan tuna vegan tuna what the hell I don't know we're gonna find out oh it looks like cat food wait a second are you sure this isn't cat food vegan tuna <laughs> ready tastes how I imagine cat food would taste I know it, whoa that's really salty it's kind of good though I mean don't get me wrong I would never buy it again no of course it kind of just like tastes like tempeh this one I got really excited about at the store, and it is a vanilla almond milk yogurt from the brand Kite Hill, which makes my favorite brand of vegan cream cheese. I learned my lesson from last time, you see? <laughs> Don't let that squirt on my face. It smells like cottage cheese. It smells cheese. like cheesecake. Cottage cheese. Cheesecake. Pineapple and cottage cheese. No? That's so specific. <laughs> it does to me. Pineapple and cottage, cottage cheese. <laughs> Shut up. Mm. That's actually really good. Very good. It's like, I like how tart it is too. It tastes like cheesecake, am I, I right? Nope, it tastes like spot on like cheesecake. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah <laughs> I like, like, I, you're I like, you're like, bitch! Like, nope, got cheese I don't know. <laughs> shut, shut up, it does taste like cheesecake though. So good. Next, we're gonna do chocolate kale. Chocolate kale? Chocolate kale. Ew, these are such big pieces. Smell it. I, they always smell different. Don't. Ah! You, what the hell? <laughs> Come on. Don't be cheating. I'm not cheating. You gotta just put it in your mouth. Okay. It's so big. All right. Oh, that's a lot of it in the windows. <laughs> One, two, three. It's good. Uh, I don't even taste kale. Me neither. Wait, I do. Now I do. It like Brussels sprouts. It does. Why? Like burnt Brussels sprouts. Mm -hmm, it's good. I can eat this like as a dinner. This one looks a little terrifying. Tofurkey pockets, broccoli, oh, turkey, broccoli, and cheddar. That does not look good. That looks gross. Agreed. Let's eat it. Tofurkey pockets. Tofurkey pockets. Here we go with this. Well, it looks like a Hot Pocket. It comes in like a little microwavable pouch. We're gonna put it in the microwave. Let's see what we're working with in here. Oh, I mean, it looks pretty normal <laughs> for a Hot Pocket. That looks gross. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh my God. I think it actually looks good. Ready? It does not smell good. Mmm. Oh, that's really good. It's good, see? <laughs> it's good. That's actually pretty freaking bomb. Oh my god, I can eat the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're gonna eat the whole thing. Okay. <laughs> that's so good. That literally tastes like, like legit, almost a real thing. Now we have jalapeno, Harvardi style block. 
<laughs> this is a dairy-free spicy cheese block. How do you say? Is it Daya or Daya? I think it's right. I think you're right. Daya. Because it's D-A-I. Daya. 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 What? There's a peel tab right there. Ooh, it, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> oh my, it is really hard. Ew. I think it needs to be cut in slices though. All right, whatever. Cheers. That's good. Holy crap, is that good. That's good. I, girl. And I like how spicy it is, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I dig it. I want it. I need it. I gotta have it. I'm real excited for this one. <gasps> I know there was mac and cheese in my last one, but this is a new brand and it's pizza. Pizza, pizza mac and cheese. So good. I can already tell it's good. All, the, all that stuff there, that brand is really good. All right, we gotta go to the kitchen to make this one. We gotta go to the kitchen cam. <laughs> Here we go, mac and cheese pizza. Smell that packet, David. Let us know. I can already smell it just opening it. Mm. It literally smells like pizza, like pizza chips. Have you ever had pizza mm -hmm. chips? Like Pringles. Yep. There we go. Yo. Freaking smells like it to the max. Macaroni's been cooked. I am adding in what is it? Like two tablespoons of vegan butter, which is just this. And some almond milk. Is that too much? <laughs> that was great! <laughs> Girl, it's gonna be like soup now. It'll be fine. And then the, no. the powder mix. <laughs> it's gonna be horrible. No, it's okay. Look at, oh. Stop, it's fine. It'll thicken up. There we go, mac and cheese soup. <laughs> Thanks to me. It's fine. Come on, it's not that bad. Mmm, soup. Listen, look, it's already thickened up. Look oh, at it. Look darling, at it. Darling. David. <laughs> look at it. It's look. It's not soup. It's mm. perfect. Darling, you made me macaroni and cheese soup again. Mm, love it. Stop, don't. The other kind was so much better. That is like, why did it taste Really like, fake cheese taste. Like really like fake. Really fake. All right, talk about some terrifying shit. This is the scariest thing in the whole video. What? What'd you get? No! Vegan smoked salmon. I thought the tuna was bad. Ooh. Why did they have to do the transparent? Like, do you see that? Mm-hmm. This isn't gonna be good, I can only tell. What the hell is that? It looks like my skin! <laughs> it literally looks like my skin. Styrofoam. It tastes like some kind of lunch meat. Literally styrofoam. Tastes like really cheap turkey lunch meat. No, bologna. No, oh, turkey. This is something that was actually gifted to me that I've been waiting to try for you guys. By D's Naturals, it's called Chocolate Fudge Cake Batter. Protein infused almond fluff butter. It's really, oh it's really funny though, because when I said in my last video, if you have a food company and you want to send me some food, do it. And like people did. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Jesus. Winning at Never life. Never go hungry Free food, again. free food. <laughs> oh my god, Ooh, wait, do you want to do a spoon? That looks good. Okay. Literally smells like brownie batter. That's good. I can win with that. That, that was a ooh good or ooh bad? It's good, but it's really rich, intense, like peanut, like protein bar flavor. Or like put it on like toast. That'd be so good. Mm -hmm. That's cool that it's like 10 grams of protein too. It does taste, oh. it's basically a liquid protein bar. That's good. Yeah. When I saw this, I was like, this is just too good to be true. What is it? Vegan marshmallow fluff. We can make some- Most people don't realize that marshmallows aren't vegan. It's pretty freaking gross. Look it up how it's made. Yeah, look up what gelatin is and you won't want to eat marshmallow or gummy candy like ever again. Life forever changed. But this we can make some bomb ass rice krispie treats of that shit. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh my God. That feels weird. Well, it's quite different. Um, I think I'm still getting the chocolate taste. No, it's like weird. It doesn't really taste like marshmallow. It's just like sugar. 
Yeah, honestly, you're spot on. It does taste like just like sugar. Oh my god, it's... <laughs> Ew! Oh my god, that looks gross! Ew, that looks so disgusting. These I thought looked interesting. Here's this one. Chips that are, I think they're beets. There's beets. There's... Beets, blue potatoes, sweet potatoes, gold potatoes. That this reminds me of, did you used to watch Allegra's Window? No. Am I too, I'm so old. You're not old. Allegra's Window, they had this like mythical, I think it's mythical, vegetable called a rutabaga. Is a rutabaga real? A rutabaga is real. It <laughs> is! <laughs> oh, and they're like striped like this. Yes, it's real. I didn't know, because oh. I've never seen one. Anyway. Oh my god, it's crunchy. It's crunchy and real. I, I'm di I dig this. This is amazing. What about blue potato? Oh my god, they're really pretty too. Oh, purple. That is purple. Mm. I like how each one has a different consistency. Because mm. the pizza is way crunchy, but the soup, I mean, the blue potato is like soft and just all. Oh god, sweet potato is going to be amazing. Last thing in the bag. What is it? I've been holding out on this one. Oh my god. Hickory, sage, smoky, saucy, savory bacon. Freaking bacon. Plant bacon. I don't know. The, the thing with bacon is like, that's like my one thing. Even when I was younger, I, I hated bacon. Like, it's not. Well, because like, when I was young, one of my favorite movies was Charlotte's Web. Oh, yeah. We're just literally like talking about, no, don't kill my pig. Don't turn into bacon. <laughs> and it's like. It's sad. Yeah, it made me so sad. So. Just the thought of it being real, like tastes like bacon or even the, the flavor. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's like so much um, juice. <laughs> oh, my God. Are you making. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Doesn't really look like bacon, but honestly, I would be disturbed if it did. Well, it's got Boogie's interested. Boogie's interested. <laughs> uh, no. It really did smell like bacon. Oh god, spot on. Here we go. How much sodium is in this? A shit ton. Ready. Oh my god. This is exactly how I imagine those bacon bacon strips done. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Why do you have to say that? Because now, for real, right? if you if anything could smell like it or taste like it, it'd be the dog the bacon bits. Mhm. Mm to the T. Mhm. Mm so salty too. So salty. So gross. What? <laughs> you're so you're so idiot. No, thank you. That is gross. That's just how I am. If there's something edible in front of me, I'm gonna keep eating it. I like the texture though. Oh, hot pocket it is for me. <laughs> well, there you go. Taste test number two. Had some pretty good things. Had yeah. Some pretty good things. Some more than others, but it was so good. <laughs> actually, there was some pretty decent stuff that I'd actually really, buy again. Really, really good stuff. Yeah. I think it'll be really funny to look back on these taste test videos in like 10, 15 years when I'm just like laughing at myself for trying all like the new things when it was gross. Like, remember when vegan cheese tasted like shit? Like, ah. <laughs> remember when there was styrofoam salmon? So gross. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you guys liked this, which I feel like you did because it's like my most viewed video right now. So I'm just like, I need to do another one. So probably do part three uh, once I find enough stuff. Or if you want to send me some. Hey. <laughs> <laughs>